who is ready for their allotted Tuesday gaming time. The time that I have allowed. I'm ready. Good, 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 good. Uh, not, still not close <laughs> to having even a single video ready for upload. There's so much footage waiting on me. I'm at a tricky spot right now because I'm extremely busy with school and, and, and IRL stuff. That won't keep up because this week was just kind of freakish in terms of literally like four separate companies failed me at the same time. Um, my like HelloFresh stuff stopped getting delivered, which is fine. Like, that's fixed. I'm not going to whine about like, oh, my life's so hard because I <laughs> can afford HelloFresh. Uh, it's an incredible privilege to even have a HelloFresh subscription, but it, it just took a lot, took up a lot of time. The CVS the debacle took a whole day when when I really didn't need it to. I was on hold with them for five hours, and then I was sitting in the store for like three hours. Uh, so like those at the same time, my Adobe files all went missing, and then someone got a hold of my <laughs> credit card information uh, and dropped a couple thousand dollars at Mattress Warehouse. So I had to work on that, getting the money back, and also canceling my card, and also getting a new one. Plus, it's the beginning of a school year, and I had a lot of homework this week. So I haven't had that much time to work on YouTube, but I also can't just send all the footage I have out to editors because, like, <laughs> I just send in my tuition payment, so I'd, I would like to make some money. So, I like, <laughs> there's a lot going on. Uh, so your credit card to buy mattresses. Mattress. One mattress. <laughs> and then didn't use it again. I was like, I mean, I'll cancel my card, but at least it's kind of you not to drop like a hundred thousand dollars that I don't have. I guess that wouldn't work. I guess it would just say card declined. Well, I'm glad they didn't spend everything I had on that card. Instead, they just like bought a really nice mattress, I guess. <laughs> well, anyway, in any case, hello, everyone. Uh, I'll have content out shortly, but there's just a lot. Plus, it's been a while since I uploaded the last Perfection video, and I haven't even started on the new one. So I'm scared about making people wait even longer because they've already waited an unbelievable amount of time <laughs> for the next Perfection video. Plus, I want to get that done because I want to start a new Stardew Valley playthrough because it'll, at this point, basically be a blind look because my relationship with Stardew Valley... <gasps> Let me turn on camera for this part. Why is it tilted upwards? Hold on. Now it's crooked. Whatever. My relate no. <laughs> it's it won't do. God, my fucking microphone. Go on my armpit. Okay. Um, my relationship with Stardew Valley is so complicated now because it's like I there was a while where I played it just I played it until I was sick of it and then played it some more for like a year. And I just played it so much that I got to the point where I felt like I knew everything about the game. And I felt like an expert on it. And then I, I followed that up with like almost two consecutive years of basically never playing. And now instead of being back to like where I was before I played it a lot, it's like a true reset. It's like, like I literally can't remember like anything about the game. So if I played it again, it would basically be a blind luck and it would be a very casual playthrough. Uh, which I actually am looking forward to. I'd probably do it with some mods because I've never really played with mods like that make the game bigger that aren't just like quality of life so I'd probably do like a you'd do one of the mods that makes the game bigger I don't know I don't know um how that happened I don't know if it happens I guess whatever I in fact I kind of know exactly how it happened but I'm not gonna <laughs> express that uh so yeah lots to do we'll get done Um, okay. Goodbye, everybody. Actually, wait, no. I need to, I need to plug the game. I was about to turn off my face cam. Oh, cool. Native Instruments, uh, bricked. Okay. Whatever. It'll be open for the, the whole of stream. I just realized y'all can't hear the music when I'm on face cam. I'm sorry. I've just been talking to y'all in silence. I have this pretty music going on in the background that you cannot hear. Pause music. Okay. Did the driver's booting up. What are you playing today? Oh, did I forget to update the stream? Sorry, y'all. Does it still say, like, let's play Spirit Fair? I, this is what I always do. I update all the information. I forget that you have to hit done 
or else it doesn't do anything. So I forgot to hit done. Stream's been updated. Never mind, you're you're dummy. <laughs> Never mind, it's your fault. You should feel bad. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Good fade to black. Uh, okay, Dave the Diver. Capture cursor is set to off. Perfect. Okay. Stupendous. All right, we're playing Dave the Diver. This is stream nine of Dave the Diver. Oh my God. This game still feels like a new-ish series to me. I can't believe this is the ninth Dave the Diver stream. And the end of this game is still not in sight. Cause like, I don't want to stream this forever. Like I'm enjoying this game, but like I have a long list of stuff I want to do on stream. Start a new Star Valley playthrough. Gotta get back to the Sonic games. A lot going on. What do you think? Neat, right? What? Oh yeah, I expanded the, that's right. Then yeah, it is neat. Good job. Okay, my rice patty is, is and now he's working on that. He's working on my rice zone. I guess I'll grab my carrots and my garlic. I know we were growing a lot of garlic for the Marlin day, which is today. I don't know how much we actually need. Uh, carrots seem to kind of be the name of the game here in terms of actually making money, like carrots and a bit of eggplant. So what I'm probably gonna do is just do like a ton of carrots now. We have 13 open spaces. Okay, we have no excess seeds. We have 13 open spaces right now. Let's do... We, we got the habanero seeds in the ground. Let's do eight carrots. Let's do nine carrots and four eggplants. How does that sound, y'all? Good. What's this game about? Uh, maybe a hundred thousand things. So I'm just gonna let you drown in, in, in stimulus. This game has like a million mechanics, but the core idea is that I am Dave. I work at a sushi restaurant and I have to go diving every day to, to, to get Chef Boncho the fish he needs to cook delicious sushi for people and also do a hundred million other things. There's a giant sea people civilization that I have to help survive and there's this psychopath who tries to kill me. Well, there are like a thousand of those, but there's a human psychopath that tries to kill me. The rest of them are like sea creatures, which is fair. Just enough. Ah, oh, amazing. All right, cool. Job finished. <laughs> Job's finished. All right, we're going boating. Okay, let's see here. Um, I got some extra cash. I could upgrade something cheap. That could be handy. Sure. Um, cargo box would be awesome. Dive knife could be fine, I guess, but I'm not that invested. We'll do cargo box. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Eco Watcher will happen naturally. I don't think I've got really anything going on right now in terms of to-do list. Yeah, I literally don't have anything. That's right, because I have to wait two days for that door to open in the glacial passage, glacial area. So, I have a few days to just kind of catch fish and serve them. Just go through the motions. Um, okay, today's our last chance. This dive right here, I should say, is our last chance to get a hold of some marlin black vinegar thanks so if i find any i i should i should uh grab them okay they like to hang out in the shallow area same with tuna i don't have any nets because i think i already used mine for the day but whoa gravity launcher Sucks in nearby creatures and then it explodes. I like my tranquilizer, but that is awesome though. There's a Hatsune Miku stand. There is, that's right. My gun, my like gun salesman. Um, huge Hatsune Miku guy. Come here. Get back. Oh, oh. Thanks, man. DoorDash. Okay, we got some yellow tuna. I'm good. I 
Most of my enhanced dishes are blue tuna, and I'd rather save my drones for if I get a marlin or any like really valuable sharks, like a thresher shark or poor bee eagle. Or third th option, third thing. Don't stop, please, 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 please stop, please, please, don't make me. I'm not the bad guy there, right? Like that's not on me. Here, wait, come back. Now I'm the bad guy. Like here, absolutely yes. These are innocent fish. There we go. Oh, what the hell? It's just like brute forced them into a rock. I'm sorry, man. I'm not seeing any marlin. I probably have enough. It's it's fine. I probably have enough for today anyway. It's all good. We'll use our drones on sharks, I guess. Well, there's one. Never mind. Okay. Uh, let's see if I can tranquilize this thing. It's a 40% chance. Oh, you. Yeah, you come for me so I can aim for you and not something else. Okay, didn't get it there. That's fine. Didn't get it there. That sucks, but whatever. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. Okay, that was ridiculous. Six, uh, six in a row. Well, might as well still grab it. It's dead, so. I'll still use a drone. It's fine. I don't think I'd use them all if I didn't, if I passed that up. All right, well, that sucks. I want to get to that little equip box. Damn, that's crazy unlucky. Six misses in a row on a 40% chance. That's a, that is a point, what is that? Point six to the sixth power chance. Well, now I need to know what that is. This is like what my friend Brian does. Every time he gets really mad, he starts doing math. Three, four, five, six. Uh, four point six percent chance. That's pretty unlucky. It's not astronomical, but no good. <laughs> Revenge math. It's my favorite thing to do when I'm pissed off. Ah, I'm gonna calculate. Barracuda. I'm like Barra, see ya later. Around, see around, see you around. Cause I'll <laughs> see grapes. <laughs> my day, my day just got way better. I still played Ace Attorney. Therm has not played Ace Attorney, and Therm's heard of it, and that could be really fun. And Therm kind of wants to play Ace Attorney. I've got too many, too many games I want to play on stream and not enough time to stream. Once I'm like gra graduated from college, if I've still got this YouTube gig going, fingers crossed, cause I love it so much. Uh, if, if I'm still making YouTube videos by the time I graduate college and I haven't suffered some sort of accident <laughs> before then, uh, I'll be streaming like basically every day. Cause I'll have so much time on my hands. So then I can play lots of games. Yes, I would love to play Ace Attorney. Oh Jesus, oh my God. Oh my God, stop. All right. I can't remember what I used these sea grapes for, but I know I like them. Okay, I need to swing down and around to the left because Last time, I think the Thresher Shark was on the left side, and I those are so valuable. I really could use them. So I'm going to swing a left if I can help it. Oh, yeah. Okay. This way. Nice. Boo, 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 boo. Boo, 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 boo. Uh, okay, I don't need that thing. Oh, that's a wall. Never mind.
This is the wrong shark. I hope there is a thresher shark today. Because those are kind of lifting my restaurant onto their backs. And then, I don't know. Doing some other thing sharks do. Bite, I guess. Swim. Stop me if you can't keep up. I had a, my first Zoom class in college today. It was awesome because it was with a professor that I hate who is out of the country for a full month and now I don't have to don't have to go to her class in person anymore. She's just not nice. Like at all. Thresher Shark! Alright, we got... Yeah, that's okay. We got super unlucky with the Marlin. Thank God. I would have been pissed if we got screwed over again. All right, take it away. Get it out of here. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm run after it like the mom ran after the school bus to say bye. All right, so okay, now I'll go down into the glacier, the glacier zone, so I can get some uh, whatever the hell, poor beagle. Okay, some poor beagle, maybe some some Greenland shark as well. The mood strikes. Please let me get my oxygen without biting me. Please let me get my oxygen without... Wow. Thanks, man. Appreciate you. Yep. Absolutely. It's my favorite item in the whole game. Sea grapes. This way. La, la. Okay, okay, all right, yep. I don't like this part, it's, I don't like it. I don't like waiting for the current to stop. How do I, okay, this is wrong. I don't think this is where I should be going. Chemistry's awful. I like chemistry. But that's fine. One man's trash is another man's treasure. So shut up! Chemistry's hard. Well, I find it, it's, it's subjective. So. I find chemistry far easier than every single humanities class. Every English class, every history class, all of it. Anything, especially history. Every history class I've ever taken has just bored me into submission. No exceptions. I get so, so, so bored. Ooh. Yes, please! Get water. Math's my favorite. I do love math. I'll definitely take math over like some other sciences. Like bio like is interesting. Very cool. I'm just terrible at it for some reason. Just did not never clicked with me. Chemistry like totally did. See like how am I supposed to evade that? Truly how am I supposed to evade that with what I am given in life? Okay, that shark, I do not care. I do not care about you and your and your life. Eh. Please. Spare me. The one thing I am dreading uh, about 
getting back to like a Stardew Valley playthrough is I think the fact that I've basically forgotten everything about the game is gonna make for probably some of the most poignant backseat gaming experiences in my streaming career probably because like I forgot like I was watching back the perfection VODs for a bit to find like a specific clip I was looking for and it had like the chat replay up over to the right I forgot how extreme it was like I, I I had completely forgotten how extreme the the back seating was during those perfection things, cause like there's like a lot of thing to remember, things to remember, and like that game, um, Stardew Valley, cause like for the most part back seating is helpful in Stardew Valley, cause it'll be like oh you forgot something at home or like hey shouldn't you do this today instead of what you're doing something like that, but I think the combination of how many people would go to those streams. And, um, just something about the nature of the game made the Perfection series the most, like, like, ground zero for specifically the chat phenomenon of if one person says something, everyone immediately dogpiles. Like, if, if one person is, like, like, if I'm, like, hey, I forget, what gift is this person like? And someone's, like, oh, she likes salad. I will then get 30 messages after that saying like salad, 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 she like salad, she like salad, salad, salad. I was like watching back a stream. I was like, oh my God, I forgot how much, like that just doesn't really happen as much anymore. I forgot how extreme <laughs> it was with that game. Or just that whole series. Modding on YouTube game, my therapy sessions recently. <laughs> it's yeah, it's a lot. I like. I was just watching it back and there's so many times where I, I like, I don't know, I forgot my fishing rod at home. And someone's like, you forgot your fishing rod. I was like, oh, true, I forgot my fishing rod. And then like 30 people are like, fishing rod, fishing rod, forgot fishing rod, forgot fishing rod. It's like, I know, I know, I know you want to be the one to tell me, but it's already happened. You missed your chance. It's over. I says, I don't think that's, is that a dolphin? Yeah, I was about to say that's not a dolphin. Heard they're pack animals. Don't swimming alone. How sad. What a loser. Let's point and laugh. Oh, disappeared behind the iceberg. <laughs> okay. Back to work. Oh, Jesus. There are more of them behind the iceberg. Maybe I just take a picture of him. Okay. Five creatures at once. Okay, well, they are... All right, now... I got three. <laughs> so... Let's try again. Can I zoom out? I don't remember how. Z. There we go. I didn't mean to. Okay. Uh, restart. It's hard to get five at once, man. I think I got five at once. Oh, you're saying that that tail doesn't count? Or the one that's the head of the one on the left? We're done. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, I think I think the fact that Stardew Valley is as slow paced as it is makes it so much easier for people to be like Do this instead. Hey, it would be more efficient to do this instead. Hey, do you realize that like the way you're doing isn't the fastest? It's like, okay. Now that I'm not doing a series that's like dude, this dude is on my ass. Now that I'm not doing a series that's like going for perfection and it'll just be like a casual playthrough. Hopefully that'll be there will be less of that. People being like Hey, you do realize that there's actually an exploit you could do with blah, blah, blah? Okay, this guy is gonna make me scream. Stop. All right. See, now I just wasted a bullet because of you. Cool. Um, there's our last drone. And then I'm gonna see if I can go find the poor beagle of the day. I don't have very many bullets. There we go. Let's say I'm hoping I find like a bullet. We fill. Usually the poor beagle's on the right side, but I've found that sometimes it'll migrate. So I guess I'll try left side. Yeah, we'll see. Cause also just Twitch streams tend to be way chiller than the YouTube ones. So that'll probably be fine. 
I just like it, it really I can't tell if it's because I just have become more impatient and more of like a dick with time or if streaming has worn on me over time because like I was watching back those perfection streams for like two full years ago and there's so many times where like the chat would be in a state where I'd be like that would really outwardly frustrate me now but like me from two years ago was just like kind of <laughs> hanging in there I was like damn have I like am I jaded is that what that is I feel like I just have so much less patience now I want to be more patient with people but like there's so many times where the chat would be like go back go back go back Cut on this go back go back and I'd be like oh no I'm okay and now I'd be like everybody shut up <laughs> it's it's like I'm just like out of out of patience oh Jesus come on oh my god I'm getting so unlucky today with the tranquilizer wow six misses in a row yeah seven that's crazy yeah eight misses nothing we can do about that that's an even less chance than the 4.6 that I was talking about before it's probably more like I don't know like two some 1.9 somewhere around there my nose is bothering me I have like one of those things where it feels like I have something that I could get out by like blowing my nose but it's just kind of in there forever I might have to just mute my mic and go blow my nose real fast to see if I can get this worked out where's the mirror I can't remember is it the roof uh, I guess I could do that doesn't matter your patience fell off it did <laughs> genuinely Up I go. Uh, we're done. Whoa. Strong memory of throwing an argument with the drama about baseball. Yeah, it was. I I have an exact memory of when that happened. It was during the Breath of the Wild series, and it was on that part where I was carrying the ball to the pedestal in the middle of the little spiral, off on the east coast. It's because Andromeda is an Astros fan, and the Astros are the fucking worst. <laughs> <laughs> but but I'm over it though. <laughs> Shut up, dude. I'm sorry. I don't care. There we go. All right, I'm muting my mic. I'm blowing my nose. Be right back. Never mind. My whole freaking. I'm back. Yeah, I'm trying to think of like, I should make my like Mount Rushmore of the most poignant, frustrating chat exchanges I've ever had. I'm trying to think of what would be on the Mount Rushmore of like chat uh, infamy. Good job, guys. Carolina and Yoni did awesome. Uh, go back. Go back up. First one that comes to mind is Mr. Waffle. That name is so vaguely familiar, but I don't remember what that person did. <laughs> For Breath of the Wild. Oh! I forgot about Mr. Waffle. There was that other person. It was like Luga or something who had a profile picture of like a Shiba Inu with a beanie on. And they like, there were like five separate streams where they came in and were just being a general nuisance. And then there was one stream where they said something and I was like, uh, I was like, oh, I remember you. You're the one who was like a total problem. <laughs> Time you, someone clearly tagging another client out on something. Oh yeah. That was uh, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. That was the worst I've ever felt after a stream in terms of like lingering anxiety, because that was the first time there were like multiple people in chat who were like upset with something I had said. And I was worried that I was like out of line. And afterwards I was like, 
Did I do bad? And I was like talking to my mom about it. I like went upstairs and talked to my mom and I was like, I don't know if I was mean on stream today. But basically it, it boiled down to like, uh, I said I was hot. And then someone said like, did the like, I'm from Australia, that's nothing. And then I that caused me to fly into this rant about like, you do realize that temperature, like the way human bodies work, the temperature you grow up in determines how uncomfortable something makes you. So like me feeling uncomfortable in 80 degree heat has nothing to do with you feeling comfortable in 80 degree heat because I would feel comfortable in like f on like 40 degrees in shorts and you wouldn't. <laughs> so that's just kind of how it works. Um, and then they were like immediately when I did that, they were like, Hey, can like, I have anxiety. Can you please stop attacking me? And then multiple people in chat were like, yeah, this is gross. I was like, what is going on? And then like later in the stream, they like misquoted something I said that was very ad hominem. And I was like, hey, that's a misquote. And then they were like, again, I have anxiety. Please stop attacking me. And then again, people in chat were like, yeah, this is a gross power dynamic because you have a microphone and she doesn't. It's like, what is going on? <laughs> it was so terrible. And then I just ended stream and then like went and talked to my mom about it. Because <laughs> I was like, did I... Am I being mean? She was like, I don't know. I wasn't there. I was like, okay. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it was it was pretty bad. Anyway. I don't think you did something wrong. Well, this is my perspective of it. I could be retelling it poorly. So who knows if I was in the wrong, at least in some way. Because I could be like strategically misremembering it in a way that suits my view. The point is, <laughs> it was bizarre. It <laughs> made me feel bad. We're going to the sushi restaurant. Um, I'm sure there are plenty more that don't come to mind. I know the the time I was most frustrated in the perfection stream was when people were being really condescending when I died in Skull Cavern and kept saying, you should have read chat as if it's realistic that I, in like an intense gaming situation, would be reading chat to the right, like while fighting something. If people were like, you were told to read chat. Something about the phrasing of you were told really set me off. I was like, shut up. Hello everyone, <laughs> this is you. Oh, I forgot. I don't care what you say. That's a new challenge. It's two people. Is it a tag team? It's Luigi. Excuse me, your name is Lois. Oops. Long time no see. Oh my God, it's Lois. Last time I saw you, you owned a restaurant, a five-star hotel. Now this kind of shabby restaurant. Shock dishes didn't sell well or something. I forgot this was the part of Boncho's backstory. She's rude. Is she the restaurant critic who defamed you? Your source from Miss Yoshi? Right, that's she. What brought you to a lovely place like this? That you'd be only prestigious restaurants. Well, my previous review of your restaurant became a thorn in my side. My reputation suffered from comments saying I was closed minded, disqualified as a taster, etc. My career as a restaurant critic has declined since then. Wow, so you both took an L from that. Then we do numbers on Tumblr. I would do numblers on Tumblr. I do have a tweet that says this shit gonna do numblers. Maybe that's a sign. Also, I don't think I would. From my experience, I don't think I fit in with, with the general sense of humor and vibe of Tumblr. Sometimes. Sometimes I feel like I do. My friends and I, for the last few months, whenever we're bored, have been doing a lot of you quizzes. And I've been told that's a great representation of Tumblr humor, and I really don't vibe with it at all. Like, most, like, you quizzes I take, I don't find even remotely funny. It's just a lot of, like, arson, tax evasion. It's like, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm failing to see the humor here. But who knows? The quizzes are very fun. Yes, that's absolutely true. Oh, because you served me a disgusting fish. Let's take a you quiz right now. <laughs> I'm, like, way too impulsive to be a streamer. Okay, hold on. You quiz. Um... Hold on. We're doing a U quiz. <laughs> It'll be fun. <laughs> Just really fast. Um, where's my Google Chrome window? Google Chrome. Oh, that's my physics homework. Hold on. What, how do I oh, center? Let's see. Center. We're doing a U quiz. 
What's you quiz? It's like this is a website. That, it's like it's like BuzzFeed quizzes, but it's a website that is purely um, dedicated. This fucking show! Oh my god! Okay, hold on. Let me turn on show cursor. Why did it just delete my Google Chrome? Oh, there we go. This show is inescapable on Twitter, and I hate it now. I don't know anything about this show, and now I can't help but fucking hate it. Leave me alone. There's two of them! I didn't even notice there's a second one on the right. I don't like these. Yeah, I don't like these people. I'm sorry. Something about the design creeps, like not creeps me out because I know the whole point is I think it's supposed to be that they're evil, but like it grosses me out. I guess is another way to say it. Something about it, man. <laughs> it makes me uncomfortable. It's it's the only thing in my Twitter page, and I don't know anything about it. Let's find out what uh, character I am <laughs> from it. <laughs> but yeah, it's a website where you literally anyone can make a quiz. It's all like chronically online Tumblr people. So all the sense of humor is like Tumblr, but like old Tumblr. Uh, yeah. Okay. Whatever. Here we go. Uh, hi, I saw there were a bunch of these quizzes, but they all sucked. So I'm taking it upon myself to make an actual good one. Thank me later. Enter your name. Fart. Subscribe for more. Oops. Uh, let's get an intro. This is so hard to read, by the way. I hate that they made the font orange. Let's get an intro. How would you typically greet someone over text? Well, I do forget to respond most of the time. That's accurate. Uh, shit ton of emojis. No. I do. Hey is my go-to. I always do hey. Maybe howdy if I'm f close friends with people. Uh, but I'd say this re this uh, applies the most. Because I'm, I'm like notoriously bad at replying with text. Because what happens is I reply to them in my like dreams. That sounds like an excuse, but it's true. Like, I, like, dream that I have replied to somebody. And then I'm like, all right, done. And then, like, months later, I realize, like, holy shit. Dry ah. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> okay. What motivates you? My peers, knowing there's multiple... Nope. Knowing there's people cheering for me. Yeah, that's accurate. Attention. I guess kind of I'm a YouTuber. My whole job is attention, but knowing I'm helping others, self-satisfaction, love, motivation. I haven't felt that in a while. Oh my God, this is so freaking motivation. Haven't felt that in a while. <laughs> Shut up. My peers is accurate. Yeah, okay, you can use cookies. I don't I don't care. All right. Um, why did you join the Hasbin Hotel? What do you mean? Like the fandom in the show? I don't know the plot of the show. Why did you join the Hasbin Hotel? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm glad they added that option. Why'd you go to hell? Oh, I see, I see. I don't know. Free place to crash sounds good, but I guess, oh, uh, I don't know is accurate. Favorite song from this year? I don't know. I haven't heard of any of these songs. I haven't watched the show. Hell's Greatest Dad sounds funny. Fuck it. Uh, favorite color? Green. How do you manage stress? Talking to others? Distractions. Distractions. A hundred percent. What character do you think is most attractive? Again, have not seen the show, so we're going to pick it based on name. Serpentious. Is it a snake? Is that the joke? Is it a snake? Husk sounds dramatic. Charlie is a normal person. Name. Angel Dust. Immediate F tier. What the fuck kind of name is that? That's that's a gamer org. And then that's pretentious. So we'll go with Charlie. <laughs> a person name. Should I actually Google these people or should I just do name? Aren't they like animals? Well, shit, man. Then none. <laughs> I feel like... I don't know. I'm picking the one with a normal name. Uh, what is your greatest fear? Any insect being alone, being viewed as a failure, the dark Jesus, uh, spider. I, I know, but they're technically not insects. I am pretty terrified of the concept of what happens after you die. Are you more of an introvert or extrovert? Introvert. How have you been answering the questions? The first answer is someone like me. Yeah, and that's what I just did here too. 
Vag vagi vagina? <laughs> Yo, what the flip, bro? Okay, well, uh, you're stubborn. First two words. This seems to be a theme. <laughs> okay, she seems rad. Well, let's do one more at you quiz. Um, are you girl or boy pretty? Are you pretty cute or hot? I want to find out if I'm pretty cute or hot. My name is Thunk. There you go. She's a celebrity. Uh, Zendaya is the only one I've heard of, so. She's a color green. She's a hobby. Sports. Copper, silver, or gold? Copper. Hair, short. Silly ah question. Choose an emoji. These are not emojis. They're emoticons. I use this one constantly. That's it. That was it. That was literally it. Oh, I closed it. I closed it. Oh, no. <laughs> I crashed the website. Okay, hold on. Oh, Chrome updated. All right, hold on, guys. I'm going to go ahead and take that again really fast. Wait, now it's different. Are you? Oh, no, this is your girl pretty or boy pretty. I, I picked the wrong one. Uh, Pretty cute or hot? Zendaya. <laughs> Green. Sports. Copper. I'm picking the top one every time. Short, smiley face, blah, 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 blah. I'm pretty. <laughs> I'm pretty. You have the eyes of an angel, the grace of a ballerina, and the attitude of a pretty person. Sorry, guys. We can play Dave the Diver now. No need to speak of that. Oh, it's over. It's Pastro, the soul of Italy. Let me introduce Pastro Anto Giovanni. I brought him from Italy to teach you what culinary elegance really means. Ciao, amico. Heard a lot about you. Blah, 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 blah. Today's team is pasta. That's so unfair. Whatever. Stay tuned. Goodbye. Okay, that's enough. Goodbye, Lois. Well, yeah, Dave is as incensed as I am. Now turn on face cam. What, after it told me I'm pretty? I can't. It's not working. <laughs> I'm pretty. Diagnosed pretty. <laughs> it's terminal. I saw this show on TV and found that one of the sponsors of the show is B and C Company. Sorry, y'all. I don't have it in me. All right, there we go. This is all I need is the list. I just need a Humboldt squid. We already have everything else. Okay. Three wheat and three garlic. We're probably gonna use some garlic though, aren't we? So, all right. It's D Day. It's Marlin Day. So, um. Look at all these things I can get. This is only one? What the hell? Phantom jellyfish jelly. Dude, jellyfish jelly. Hey, all you people. Hey, all you people. Yeah, I'll research that. Uh, and the roasted whatever the hell. Cool. Um, yeah. Wow, I, I have a lot of boss kills. That's right. I killed like three bosses in one go. Mantis shrimp we also haven't done. Anything that costs one artisan flame is a boss creature that sells for a lot. So, okay. Now I'm just going to save up my artisan flames. All right, now, menu. We're going to save our boss food for tomorrow. Today, the focus is Marlin. Um, so, this is, yeah, we got garlic. We've got miso. So, we're going to enhance once. I've miscalculated. I used up all of my miso to enhance it. Well, they're getting plain sushi. They're getting plain. And they're gonna have to deal. We have lots, so it's fine. 
Uh, 51. Yeah, we can afford that because then we'll put it on auto supply. All right. That's all good. It's not the biggest issue. And then we'll have to provide some other stuff for people uh, who don't necessarily want Marlin. We've got that. That's 10. We could do, we could just do one of those, man. Easily. The 724 is max level. Yeah, 724 and it makes 10. That is so awesome. Uh, there's also, what was the other one we got? The other like boss dish. There's another one. I must just not have the ingredients to make it. It's probably at the very top of, yeah, Phantom Jellyfish Jelly. Uh, I need more buck bean from the glacial area. We can make that happen. Uh, okay. So then I guess with the rest, we'll do, uh, I want to have one day where we serve up three boss things and just make an extreme amount of cash. So we'll just do some Thresher Shark maybe, or some poor Beagle. Um, yeah, we'll do Thresher Shark on auto supply. Keep it simple. All right. Keep it simple, stupid. I forgot there's also cocktails now. Goddamn. Let's go to work. Hello, Marlin people. Hey, go, go pour the tea. Pour the tea, guys. Dude, I need more employees. I'm shocked they haven't let me get more yet. Because, like, I literally do not have enough people right now to... Never mind. They're doing awesome. <laughs> Sorry. Never mind. That person needs food. Oh, it, it's getting there. Uh, uh. There we go. Okay. Perp. I don't think I know how to do the cocktail yet. Damn it, I was gonna do that one. I have to go all this way. Okay, I need to go refill the miso. Go for the, yeah, nice. Oh, the person needs a cocktail. I'll get there. No! There's literally too much. Too many people are ordering beers. Dude, I don't know how to do the cocktail. I do not. All right, we're not getting five stars, but I, I, I do not know how to do cocktails. It's over. We probably made a good bit of cash. If I had to guess. Yeah. Wow. 25,000. From all the rich people from the yacht party. That's crazy. All right, well, we made fat stacks today. That feels pretty good. I can't lie. Cops all grunt. I know. I know. I always go there first anyway. Okay, I need to figure out how to get a Humboldt squid. Uh, fine. Humboldt squid. I'm sure it's in the glacial area. Good morning. Good morning, son. Get some wise. And then we got lots of carrots and peppers. There's a lot of farming to be done today. Money yippee. Dude, literally. Done. Okay. 11. 11 openings. Um, what else could I get with... Oh, a sprinkler would be great. I got an achievement for that. 
Okay. Now, I guess I'll do five carrot, four eggplants, and then a couple of garlic. Look at that. My sprinkler. Crazy. Now I don't have to water anything ever again. Easy greasy. Coop is looking messy. It's because I refuse to upgrade the coop because I don't use eggs for anything. Oh, my, uh, my baby. My gal. Oh, uh, poop. Poop. Warning. What is it? What? Uh, clean. What does this skull mean? Did he die? Sorry. Um, did he, did I, did he die? What does this skull mean? Oh, sorry. Um, we're going to play. Did you have fun? I'm glad. I'll heal you. Maybe this skull means you're sick. Yay! Now you're doing so well. And you've been and you're being disciplined. Okay, we're done. <laughs> See ya. We're going to the boat. Okay. Whatever. Uh, farming report is available. I just was there. Shut your trap. Uh, okay. Um, I need to find a Humboldt squid. If I go into my to-do list, does it, like, tell me where to get that? Uh, 50 to 130 meters. Maybe it's a nighttime fish. See, I wish I could, like, see more about it. Is it in my, like, is there a app that is, like, here's some fish, your fish? Uh, fishmon. Yeah, yeah. Make believe fish. Here we go. Okay. Um, blue hole shallows. Um, it would be in the medium depth. I probably haven't gotten one yet. I definitely have not. Yeah, I don't know. It's out there somewhere. Whatever. We're leaving. Wait. Okay, let's do I Diver. Um, I would like to hire more people, dude. Jesus. Air tank. Cargo box. Harpoon gun. Dive knife. Let's, um... Harpoon, I guess? I don't know. I just kind of think it looks cooler now. Alright, whatever. Let's go to work. Let's go to our gamers. That little you quiz diversion was fun. Okay. A Humboldt squid. I'm looking it up. I don't care. <laughs> I don't have it in me. Uh, let's see. Humboldt squid day the diver. Yeah, it's nighttime. Okay, so I'll have to do a night dive. I guess I'll do that tonight. 
I also need to try and find some buck beans as well uh, to make that phantom jellyfish jelly tastiness tasty. Oh, was that a thresher shark tail right there? Far right? Might have been. You know, they call me Thomas Eagle Eyes Donahue back at school. Tranquilize. Oh! Tranquilize. Got him. Got him! Ladies and gentlemen, he's down! And if I find any... Oops, sorry. If I find any uh, tuna or something, we can get him with the... With the net. <laughs> I couldn't remember the term. Yep. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Is it really going to do that for each one, one at a time? Yep. Yes, it absolutely is. Wow. That's <laughs> so funny. Okay. I feel like this could have been avoided with like an afternoon of coding. Watch, I'm not even going to get enough. 28, 29, 30. Okay, we're good. Then I don't have to kill these ones. Well, I might have to if they don't leave me alone. Okay, we're good. Uh, there was another pair of fish down there that I need. So I'll go around. Oops. It's gonna be a manta ray and it's gonna fly me at a million miles an hour, like faster than I can ever dream of going. Yep. Okay. Oh, there we go. Pair of fish. Damn it. Alright, they're leaving. No worries, guys. Yes! Go to work. Okay, things we'll stop for. Uh, not really much, honestly. We're kind of just going straight to the glacial area now that we found our thresher shark. So. Yeah. Cause I could just go straight from the boat to the glacial area, but I want those thresher shark cuts. They're valuable and I like them. I think a big reason for how long this game's taking me is how much time I spend on each dive. I'm like trying to min max this way too much. I have more than enough food to feed people right now. I don't need to make maximum amount of cash cause I don't really have much to spend it on right now. La 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 All right, well, I'm just going to the glacial zone, I suppose. I'll look for some buck bean, poor beagle, Greenland shark. That's really it. I always do that. God damn it. How much is this game? Genuinely don't remember, unfortunately. I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. Oh, I gotta keep up with Twitter. Baseball news. We're in the last month here before uh, spring training starts, so. Still a lot of players unsigned that could sign.
Oops. There you go. I gotta respond to something. All done. Man, just swimming all the way to the glacial area kind of sucks. Um, and I hate it. Well, that's not very fair. That's like in the doorway. Yeah, I should start just going straight there and passing up on the um, Thresher Shark. I really do not need to be doing all that. Okay. Glacial area. And then we're going to get a couple sharks. And then I guess just leave. Look for some buck bean. And that'll really be it. And then we have our second dive, which we really don't need to do frickin' anything with. Like at all. Now, where would a fella find some... Oh, God, Narwhal. Some buck bean. I can't remember where I got the first bit. It was where like the... Was it in the room with a turtle where I was hucking a turtle at a wall for a little while? Kind of think it was. Well, there's the shark I need. Okay, time out. Oh, why? Why? That was weird. Okay, there we go. Beep. What does Buck Bean look like? I think it's like orangish. That's definitely not it. It's black coral. There's some miso. Damn. Could this have some buck bean in it? I'm probably just fully wasting my time right here. Yeah, no, screw it. I'm definitely wasting my time. Okay. I don't know where Buck Bean is. We'll get it eventually. I remember it's somewhere. Like, I got a lot of it. In some like story based room that I was in with Swan, but I don't remember where. And I don't want to just slowly swim through all these little tunnels. So I won't. Oh. 
Oh, there's some. Jesus. Embarrassing. Okay. Don't. Please, please, please. Oh my god, this thing is so annoying. Whatever. Whatever. I'll leave the sesame seeds. Jesus, you're so mean. Okay, I guess I'll just look for a Greenland shark and then leave. Done. Job, job finished. Wait, no, that's a different one. I don't like that one as much. That one doesn't sell for very much, so it, it can live. I'll be the bigger man. Okay, I cannot find the Greenland shark. I might just bag it up and leave. There's more buck bean. There's a bunch more. I missed. Oh my god, grab it! These things are so hard to grab for some reason. Alright, I'm done. <laughs> I'm gonna start kind of phoning it in here, because like we're like catching plenty of fish. Definitely as much as we need to um, feed our customers. So like, all good. Expansion work is done. Awesome. Um, yeah. My baby needs to be checked on apparently. He's sick again, literally again. He's way less cute. Like infinitely less cute. That's awful sad. Wow, yeah, you are way less cute. What happened, man? <laughs> Sorry. Affection could be better, so we're gonna play a game together. Ah. Uh, I'm, st I'm staying right. Oh. Why are you mad? You won. We're done here. Okay, let me turn on my eco watcher. Is that it? Yep. Okay, well. Um. I'm gonna skip time. Yeah, I don't really need to do anything. There we go. I'm just gonna read my book. This game is so weirdly polished. Like, they did not need to add that in. They could have just had a fade out, but they did. It's crazy. <laughs> it's, it's awesome. I love it. Go, go again. Crops are done. Okay. We're gonna harvest. Um, what do you think, Knee, right? Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, <laughs> we're going to harvest, and then we're going to get our squid, and then we're going to serve up some smoosh. All right, our nutrient is very poor, so I'm going to pick... Yeah, everything died because our nutrient got so bad. So I'm going to... Weed everything. Um, pick everything, replant, and then I guess we'll, we'll we'll throw down before I replant. We'll throw down some composting fertilizer. Uh, there you go, and we'll do some for the rice as well. Okay, now, sir, how many oven spots do I have? Uh, 
seven, eight. It's kind of hard to see. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. I think 16. I believe. My farm is now sprawling. Okay, we are done here. Oh my god, my freaking creature needs help again. What is going on? Oh, he wants to sleep. He still needs to be tended to. Rebirth. No. What is the warning? What is what is wrong? He's trying to sleep, man. I just want to turn the lights off. Whatever. Whatever. This is an unnecessary stressor in my life. Okay, night dive. I almost already forgot. Like the whole thing we're doing. Ah. Let's do it. Humboldt squid. And then we're leaving. Okay. was not working okay that's perfect i need salt huge excuse me okay all right humboldt squid that's all i need this is gonna be quick in and out because everything here is whatever the word is why can i not remember the word everything here is everything is uh everything is like aggressive hostile that's the one Let's see, what is this? O2. It said that um, the Humboldt squid is 50 meters or deeper. It was like 50 to 120. It was like medium depth. So, here we go. Now we're in medium. Okay. Tranquilize. Oh my god, so annoying. I can do this all day, dude. Oh, I failed. Uh, thanks. Why did it not work that time? What the hell, dude? Thank you. This thing is so annoying. Oh. I wish I used my tranquilizer. I thought it would be the kind that I could just grab. All right, well, now it'll be lower quality. I don't think it matters for these mini games at all, so it's fine. All right, I'm leaving. That's right. Okay. Yay! I'm done. I'm finished. Okay, so I don't know how much food to prepare, so we're just gonna do auto supply again. <gasps> oh, jeez. Literally forgot you were in the game. Yeah, the noon I can handle, but it's too cold in the evening. I'm freezing to death here. Made any progress on that hot pepper too? I forgot. That's supposed to be good, wonderful. Please make this before I freeze to death. I'll be waiting. That's it. Make Django warm. Uh, serve food to Django. Okay. What, what is the hot pepper tuna recipe? Tuna rice bowl. 
Hot pepper tuna. We're making one. We're making one hot pepper tuna. Okay. Now the rest of the stuff will be on auto supply. Vegetable sushi we can enhance, which is huge. Wow, that is valuable. Now we just need to grow more eggplant. Okay. Um, seasoned kajime. Why is that? Oh, okay. It's really scrolled up. I was wondering why it was so high. That seems odd. I'm embarrassed. Okay. Uh, yeah. See, these are like kind of cut from the same cloth. We're going to do all these at the same time. Later. Today. Oh, we can make this now. There we go. And then we'll put the Thresher Shark on auto supply. Done. Here you go, bro. Now stop your whining. Does this man have schizophrenia? Why is he like... It's so hot here. It's like mid 80s at night. It's fine. It's fine. I can feel the warmth. Oh, I'm sweating. Sky beam. Dude, that, that was pretty awesome. It's quite a reaction. Glad you're not cold anymore. Whew, you saved me. I don't even know my name yet. I am Django. I think I already knew that. I collect and sell rare ingredients from all over the world. Ingredients. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Did you know I have a truffle? Mm, truffle. For a mushroom, it's hard to come by. It's a gift in exchange for your dish. Use the recipe that requires a truffle. Thanks, man. We pass this thing by this place Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Since it's cold in the evening, I'll drop by in the afternoons. Okay. Have excuse me. See you on Tuesday. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh my god. Okay, well, now, I, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, all right. Oh lord, help us all. Wasabi! Oh god, a cocktail. Someone else please do that. I don't know how. Thank you. Wait, no, no one's doing it. Uh, pink. And then... Eh. <laughs> Didn't do a very good job. That's fine. I did it. Oh no! Oh. Jeepers. I did it. That was fine. Probably like four and a half stars. Wow. Did not make much today. That's fine. Yep. 4.6. I knew it. I knew it. Okay. It's D-Day. We got a bunch of everything he needs though. So who cares? It's Thursday the 27th. Good music. D-Day. Oh, I forgot about you. Oh, we did it. Baby man just cut it. It's very thick and tough. It is large enough now for a person to go through. Come down here when you're ready. Let's do it, man. Uh, I should have read that about being prepared. Okay, it's chapter seven. It's the broken control room. So there's something about being ready, so maybe I should... Uh, there's mail. Yeah, I know. I, I noticed that. Okay, I'm not even going to get a chance. Shark storm party. Dude, I love shark. This is the Blue Hole Tourism Committee. Corner National Water Service. A storm will hit the Blue Hole hard for three days, and amazingly, people have started to report sightings of a variety of sharks roaming the coastal areas. We decided to utilize this opportunity to a new tourism project, the Storm Stark Party. 
Uh, what is the storm shark? What is the shark storm? Whatever. Dear store owners, do not miss the opportunity to rack up revenue. We have special breeds of sharks sighted as well. Okay. Okay. Um, that's all squared. And then ancient control room rule we'll get to. And apparently I need to check on my freaking whatever. Oh my god. Dude, this shit is really high maintenance for me. Okay, we need to play apparently. Whatever. Dude, I'm ass at this one. Got one. Oh, it's a timing thing, not a luck thing. I'm embarrassed. We're done. We need to train. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. Let's just go straight to the glacier. F it. And then in the afternoon dive, we'll dive into the normal water. It's fine. Okay. Let's get him. Cat food. Forgot, forgot the cat. Forgot about the cat. All right. Poor Beagle and Greenland shark are mine if we find them. And then besides that, we're just going straight down. That is a narwhal. I, don't, I do not want to fight you. Please don't hurt me. That was close. Oh, no. Uh-oh. That's not fair. You started attacking me while I was a mobile from a cutscene. Ground control me again. Scheme more intense. Just quickly down out of the control room. That is not fair, also. Okay, you need to seriously cut out. Oh, okay. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> any sharks about? Oh, but I've already taken a serious hit, man. Okay, well, I want to look for sharks. I, I don't want to go down yet because it's literally a shark party. So I want to make sure I'm not missing any sharks for my shark party. I should save that in case there's like a fight. Could be really helpful. Don't. Thanks. Okay, shark party. Any shark party fish? Nothing over here. There we go. There we go. One shark! Now, if there's a poor beagle, that would be epicness, epic sauce, dopeness. Dare I say pog? <laughs> I, I think I dare. I think I might just dare. Okay, well. I'm not finding any, so. Now I'm all disappointed.
narwhal. Yeah, no, that's, that guy will rip me in half. So I think I'm just gonna. I think I'm just gonna leave. All right, well we got one shark. That's fine, and we'll do our we'll use our afternoon dive in the main area and see if we can get a bunch more sharks. So it'll be fine. We'll have plenty of shark. We'll have plenty of shark come shark party day, shark storm party. All right, am I gonna get my ass kicked? It's there was some dialogue about like I gotta make sure I'm like fully Whatever dr. Bacon beaming in now. I'll be able to go in. Okay. I feel hot air coming out, out from inside Oh, it's not a good sign. Be careful Thanks, bro. I will I guess go to new region. Sure. Oh It's hot. It's just severely mutated The door is blocked by tree sap should be a way to go inside Lick it. Lick it, the sap. What is this? What's this? And what's this? Is there something heavy I can put on here? Who's this guy? <laughs> Do I seriously have to like bump that poor thing and be like, hey, you're coming with me? Yeah, that's awful sad. All right. Uh, hey, little boy. Do you hit me if I get all up in your... No, I can just grab you. Sorry, man. I'll be gentle. I don't want to drop from too high. There you go. It's a heavy snail, dude. Are you kidding me? Thank you for your help, snail. All right, I passed it. Uh oh. Snail left. And this is how we die. Hmm. Hmm. Sea scorpion and mutated divine tree fruit this is terrible. Must somehow find a way. You're probably aggressive. I'm like the smartest to ever. Uh, can I hit it? Oops. All right. I don't want to do that. Can I grab it? Okay. Well, they're all dead now. Well, not all of them, but I can grab this one. go is it on a timer oh I thought it was gonna blow it up early okay now go come at me oh it was on a timer don't hit me while I'm in a cutscene it's not fair if I draw this mutated divine tree fruit on the other door I saw earlier that is not fair I didn't have control of my guy yet sorry for whining but like Okay, uh, I'd like to reload my gun. All right, do I take it with me? It'll probably just blow up immediately, so let me go investigate first. Oh, another snail. And they stop the water jet? I can think of a way. <laughs> this way, snail. Sorry, man. All right, can you stay like right there for a little bit? Okay, I need to bring the uh, fruit with me first, I think. I didn't even see you, you blend in. Okay, you're annoying and I would like you to die. So I'm gonna ask you to... Oh, you probably have like a lot of... Nice shot, dummy. You probably have a lot of health though. Uh... No, no, we're just not going to do that anymore. Okay, the second it... Yeah, I was about to say, it goes into a lunge animation. I think I have time. Never mind. Dude, this is so annoying. Like... Am I stupid? Okay. Whatever, whatever. Let's just kill it the old-fashioned way, or at least tranquilize it long enough to... There we go. Okay. Now. All right, we got to move, Dave. I can't. 
I can't. Okay, there's got to be another way. And the snail moved. All right, so I can't bring one with me. I can't remember if there's divine tree fruit in the other room. No. Nah. Thank you, snail. Okay. Um. Oh. Huh. Wall looks loose. My collapse with the crater erupts a little higher. I gotta plug the... Well, snail has left. There we go. Very good. You do, you're doing such a good job. You son of a bitch. Oh my God, so annoying. Okay, I just gotta get all three of them like in the general ballpark. Okay. One snail. Two snails. God damn it, this is so awful. I don't think I'm doing this right. God, they are so finicky. Stay. No! Son of a bitch! This is so annoying! Oh my god, this is the most frustrating thing in the world. Yeah, I, it took way too long to get over here. It's literally already over. Yeah, because then Snail's gonna move the second I- Yeah. Clearly I'm doing something wrong because this is the most stupid shit in the world. There's no way this is intended. Dude, what am I supposed to do? Like, like, it's so obvious that it's you're supposed to plug all three holes with the three snails. But these shits just move, man. I don't know. <laughs> I have no clue what I'm meant to do here. Because I need to get it to erupt time to destroy that, which it said. Because I need that to find tree fruit. Like, I, I, I can't use it. What happens if I hit it? Nothing. I've got no clue. Can you tranquilize him? I doubt it, because you it's not scripted that you'd come in with a tranquilizer. That's just the gun that I have. Oh my god. That is such a frustrating. I like. I was so sure I was doing it wrong because of how obnoxious that was. That sucked. Okay, done. Done. Control room. Oh, shit. Okay, we're fine. Oh, I could have made that. That's okay. It's no sweat. Whoops. Oh! Please stop. Please stop. Okay. All right, babies. Uh, oops. I was just going to tank it, and then I... That's fine. <laughs> Whatever it takes.
What are those? Eggs? Yeah. Are they attached to divine tree roots? I don't know. Maybe they're fruit. Whoops. Never mind. They're evildoers. I've seen one of them in people's murals. Tenzin once told me the, an ancient engineer altered the creatures by infusing the divine tree energy. You need to be the creatures. Okay. So, I did it. Oh, I need to kill them? Probably do that. <laughs> Let me get more gun bullets for my gun. Okay, son. Come on, bring it over. Let's go. Snail. You're so helpful. Okay. Oh my god, it's a normal divine tree for oh lord I haven't. Even more eggs here. They're ready to hatch, but I can't go back now. There's a door there. If I can melt the music cover, yeah, I wonder. Wow. Put that in the device. Dude, let me do that. <laughs> Come on. Whoops. Traction's working. Okay, well, now they're all gonna... Yeah. Oh, it's only four of them. The eggs are hatching! Okay. There we go. There we go. Yeah. What if I just... Oh, this is way faster. I'm uh, done. Can I man the, uh, the machine? Yes. Bzzzt. Can I use the lasers on them? There you go. This is what I wanted to do from the beginning. This is good. I like it. All done. They're growing in number. Yeah, I'm working on it, son. This is fine. This is fine. It's time to eliminate one them once for all. I need you to use the eyes that you have to see how many more eggs are left. Okay, well, my... Yeah, my thing can't... Oh, never mind. They walked right into it. Let's see, my thing can't reach that high. But they turned around. So that's super cool. I'm going to do that. I done. Wait, we're not done. Yeah, why are you putting it down, dummy? What do you mean that should be the last one? There's still a million eggs. Ah, done. I'm the big winner. Does it melt me? No, I'm all good, apparently. Neat. Since a dangerous creature's presence enter, yeah, I'm sure it'll go great. I've been really on a hot streak with bosses lately in this game. Oh, it's hot. The offspring of the ancient creature is clinging onto something. It's the nucleus of the divine tree. Is the divine tree's acting strange? You give it these creatures first. Oh, I did it. Okay, well, let me check what's on the floor. Because <laughs> there might be treats. Okay. Oh, is that a larva? How's that possible? We're underwater. It's fine. Um, like, I get if it was like... I guess it would work. I don't know. What do I know? Hey, guys. Can you stop? Can you... S can you stop? Oh. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, I'll just go do it by hand. I can't reach. How do I get this one? It's out of my reach. It's in like foreground. Check my phone. <laughs> I'm gonna stretch. There we go. I don't know why that. That's fine. <laughs> that was pretty whack. Looks like the divine tree's nucleus is stabilized again. It's definitely a living thing. The earthquake will stop now. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's probably a big evildoer. Oh, never mind. I thought I thought that was like its big pregnant belly. It was like, oh, it's having so many babies. Uh oh, is that the mom of those creatures I saw earlier? No wonder there were eggs everywhere. Hi. You're a biggin. Oh wait. Come on, roar. Give me like a roar. Never mind, you're actually pretty chill, I guess. Hello. Dr. Bacon. What's going on here? That huge monster came out from the lava. Mm, I know what that is. Seen it a lot in text. Of it. Okay. It's a yaoi. <laughs> cool. An ancient beast from legend still alive. It's massively bigger. Zebo Elder told me about some old experiment. Yeah. Yeah. You have to defeat it to stabilize the giant tree. Okay, cool. Took down a dinosaur just a moment ago. No, it's a different situation. I don't have any weapons or bullets now. Oh. Zap. Dave, isn't the weapon right here? Oh, I have to use this. This drone has all kinds of hidden features. New day would come, but it's sooner than expected. Okay, shut up. Drone's in attack mode. Wow, I can do that? Yeah, doy. It just like stuck out a little camera. Manipulate time. Okay, timeout. If you press this, you can temporarily manipulate time. Well, I don't What do you mean manipulate time? How the hell there's the roar how the hell is duff gonna be able to manipulate time? Can you just run away now. All right, let's deal with this um, I see fire Fire. Oops, that's fine. Oh, it's like Space Invaders. <laughs> that's really funny. I'm on you, man. I'm on you. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. There's three things to look at with my peripheral, dude. Oh, something scary is coming. Oh. What happens if I don't hit him? Oh, okay. See, this is more my style. As boss fights go. I don't know if I should be going for body or head or body or head or what. I'm gonna kill all of them. For the bonus level. <laughs> I'm on you, son. I'm on you, I'm on you, I'm on you. Oh. Turn off the lights. Okay. Oh. Did time reset? What the hell even just happened? Current tackle may not be enough. This enemy's tougher than we expected. Didn't want to go this far, but let's unlock the limiter. Whatever. Put the trim card right at the beginning of the game. Just watch this. Alright, son. It's Stella Laser! Superpowered laser combining all our tech. Never thought we'd use underwater. Hmm. Pay attention. If you hold space bar, you can gather stellar energy. Let go of the button to fire. Uh, okay. And I move slower while charging. Okay, well, I'm gonna do that immediately. Hmm. 
laser. Okay, now I'm gonna keep it simple. Never mind. It's fun. <laughs> All right. Oh wait. Yeah. I can dodge that. There we go. Ooh. Uchi. Uchi. I'm being too stingy about not wanting to slow time. What hit me, man? I was doing such a good job. I'm gonna melt your kids. <laughs> oh, didn't work. Okay. Uh. There we go. Oh, excuse me. Okay, they give you a lot more like time slowing than I thought, so I should be more liberal with that. Okay. Jesus! This is like tr tripping out my eyes. What the hell? It was like invulnerable when I did my awesome laser beam. How does that not kill all your kids? <laughs> that is Bologna. Dude, how many more of these laser show things do I need to do? Oh my God. Dude. Oh, this is the perfect attack to charge a laser during. Whatever! 600. This is my least favorite attack. I'm really bad at it. I think we did it. I think we got her. That was the, definitely the most fun boss fight. It might not be over, but that was definitely the most fun boss fight of this game so far. I liked it. It was very fun. I'm trying to run away. If we don't kill now, it could cause problems. Let's get him. First try. Thank you, Earl Grey Guzzler. I'm going to eat a chocolate covered pretzel. Nom, nom. Oh my God. Okay. I got I to gotta be more careful. I'm totally gonna die. Is that just phase one? Probably. I am likely going to die. Just, you know. Oh, yeah. Flamethrower is perfect. What the hell? That's so unfair. <laughs> flamethrower, that's perfect. That was hilarious. Well, every other time that a flamethrower started from the bottom. I had no indication it wasn't going to do that. <laughs> it's not very fair. Okay, well, I get to restart from here and I have full health now instead of just like 80 or whatever I had. I'll tank some damage to do a laser beam. Never mind. I don't even need to take damage. You know what I mean? Manipulate time is so fucking stupid. I love it. Okay, it's gonna go down the middle apparently. I, 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 laser beam! Yeah, I'm cool tanking a bit of damage for that. That's fine. Slowing time is the funniest shit to me still. In David the Diver. Especially the sounds like the boom. Oh, I'm effed. You're fine. Laser beam! Laser beam! Laser beam! 
habe. Oh, seems just finally tired. Now's your chance, Dave. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh shit. Look what you've done. Uh oh. Whoa, that was close. It's using his last bit of strength. They moved that open path for now. It won't be able to hold on much longer. Jesus, that is pretty sad. Okay. So I just need to avoid it, I guess. Oh my god. <laughs> Slowing down time is so funny. literally can't oh no yeah dude when it does that against the wall there's literally nothing you can do okay there we go I have 29 health. <laughs> uh oh. It's a dead end. What should I do? Shoot it, man. Uh. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ty. Yee. That's <laughs> so funny. I don't know where my keys are on my keyboard. <laughs> that was really funny. I love the double thumbs up, Dave. Good as a take on the divide tree. This is like an opportunity to finish it off. This feels terrible. Jones needs to be on my function. I can't pick up the weapon signal. What should I do? Is there anything useful around here? Uh, divide tree fruit. I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's convenient. Hello. Look at all this hard work I've done. Yeah, right here, man. Oh, see people. Came down here because you didn't come up, even though the divine tree was stabilized. Is that Yaoi? Has it grown that big over this long period of time? Seems like we need to defeat that creature to end this. Yeah, okay, doi. Won't be enough. Let me use divine tree fruit device. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I'm sorry. Finish off by dropping a snail on it. That would be an awesome way to end things for sure. Okay, I would like to play now. I'm ready to play. Good job, guys. I won't let you down. Thanks for holding on, team. You did. Oh. There you go. <laughs> you did great. All right, I'm ready. Device is responding. You pesky nuskins. You pesky nuskins. Whoops. This feels really mean. Like, I'm sorry. Like, I fail to see. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I was about to say, I fail to see. Like, I get that the divine tree was malfunctioning. I don't think this thing was intending to do that. I think y'all mutated it. So it just was trapped on here. So I don't know. It had kids that I then killed a lot of. And then it was mad at me. Seems pretty reasonable. Jesus. My aim was precise. It won't recover from that state. Do you think? Do you think it won't recover from that state? Oh my God. This has really been an incredible journey. What the fuck? It wasn't even like doing any... Whatever. It's fine. 
I didn't even get to like get some from it that I could serve my whatever. Water temperature is stabilized and divine tree fruit is also in good condition. The villagers who were ill seem to be slowly improving. I did it. We've faced many we I've faced many challenges, but it's a relief that I've managed to overcome them. I think the earthquakes on the mainland will stop as well. How about going up and checking the status? Job human, come and visit us often. Why? Why would I do that? What do I have to gain? Epilogue! Oh! Is this the end of the game? Whoa! Wrap up your day, but I didn't even do my afternoon dive. It's already nighttime. It's been a long day. I think I'll drop by Boncho Sushi. Oh my god, will you? Jesus. Holy shit, did I finally beat Dave the Diver? Look at all my friends. Duff is a hologram. <gasps> Ow. Hey there, Dave. You're finally back. I forgot you're in the game, Cobra. <gasps> Jesus. I'm having just like brutal <gasps> reflux right now. Oh my god. Everyone's gathered here. We heard from Dr. Bacon. You've accomplished a lot. I have. It's true. Wow. That was really sudden. Awesome. I was worried I might have to get right back to work. We should all celebrate. Oh, and I get a chance to talk to like the two people I like and then the rest that I feel really neutral about. Sammy! It's been a while, Boncho Sushi. How are you, Sammy? You enjoying your life here? You know it. Times I get a bit bored. Oh boy. There are times when I get a bit bored. It's also incredibly inspiring, yo. The new song I recently released, Farmer Daddy? The song I recently released, Farmer Daddy, online has been getting great feedback, you know. I'm glad, Sammy. So you're still making music, huh? For sure. Sound of a hoe hitting the ground. <laughs> the clucking of a hen. It's all just one big beat to me, yo. I don't like the phrase of the sound of a hoe hitting the ground followed by the word beat being the all capitalized word. <laughs> Jesus, Sammy. All right, Duff. Why didn't you come in person? Because I'm waiting for an important parcel today. I've been inspired from afar by your bravery, Dave. The way you fought tirelessly to save the Sea People Village. If you were a beautiful girl, I might have joined your fandom. All right, Duff. I'll pour all my energy into weapon research to prepare for any upcoming crises. I can send you my bathwater if you want. As your colleague, I'm counting on your continued efforts, Dave. All right. <laughs> Otto, a true feast. You're always so busy, we've hardly had the time to chat. Now that things are calmer, I have plenty of time to share with you some more of my stories. I'm um, sure. Back in my diving days, I was mostly into free diving. Okay. Yoshi, Dave, you've worked really hard. It's gratifying to see your venture prospering. Sorry, thanks to you for providing such a reliable servant. I'm having a hard time today. <laughs> Is something I've noticed. You must have had your playful with all kinds of things, but now I hope you can support Boncho in running the restaurant effectively. Boncho's a bit stubborn and might stir up some problems if left to his own devices. Can I feed the cat? Yes. Nope. It just it just goes meow meow. That's fine. It's, I'm still enjoying that. I don't like Udo. <laughs> it's just the sad truth. Sorry, guys. Cobra, good job, Dave. How much do you want to bet? How long do you think it's going to be before he just laughs at the end of a sentence when nothing funny was said? Only opened a shop here because this place is plenty of fish. You knew it had such a secret. Well, you saw the problem, and my business is booming now. Guess my decision's right after all. There it is. It's a fun experience. Coming here was a good idea. Was it? Thinking about seeking out another adventure. What do you think? No. No. Ellie! For some seeing the shop, huh? I like Ellie. Well, I just finished submitting my papers. I'm a bit free. Good. I'm glad for you. Eh, that eco bag there. I haven't seen it before. Ha 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 ha. You have sharp eyes. It's the reward for maxing out the eco-watcher level. It's a service that prints the faces of users committed to environmental protection on a bag. I'm almost there, actually. You've really been putting a lot of work in since you got some free time. You can't fall behind. Oh. I don't like you either. <laughs> okay. Dr. Bacon! 
Still can't believe what happened. Not just the sea people civilization, but the village too. You can solve their crisis. Great job. No, we should keep the civilization secret. We need to maintain the peace they've regained. Okay. Boncho. Try couldn't be much help. Busy with the shop. What are you talking about, Boncho? These people loved your cooking. Mm, that's the case, I'm glad. Now there are no more earthquakes. Let's get to work. Nope, that's, that's fine. Oh, Vincent, are you here alone tonight? That's embarrassing. Didn't come here to rate your restaurant today, so don't stress. Take it easy. When I dine in peace, I can savor the intricate flavors more. It's delicious. Happy to hear that. I guess my prejudices have worn off. But there's no denying there's been a slight change to the taste. Any taste changed. It's a bit smoother. You could say it's softer. Before, the dishes were brimming with the chef's strong-willed style, but now it feels more accommodating to the customer. Interesting. So that translates into the taste as well. Well, it might just be my perception. Oh, okay. Now I gotta grab my beer. It's a lot tougher than I thought, but... I met a lot of nice people in the end. This is hilarious. Looking back, it was a fun adventure. Not really. Well, it was a fun game, but like it didn't seem fun from Dave's perspective. Never would have visited a place like the Sea People Village in my life were I not given the opportunity. Okay, let's relax and go for another exciting dive. Kickstarter. <laughs> Support us on Kickstarter. It really was our Dave the Diver. <laughs> Sammy! Sammy wasn't in the picture. No, Sammy! Oh, what? who is that? Oh, it's the sea people. <gasps> Duff. Oh my god. <laughs> Good shit. <gasps> They're building a statue of me! Oh wow. Look, I got you a prize. I want to see... I'm not going to be fully satisfied by this ending unless I see Lois, like, bawling and throwing up on the ground. And John Watson impaled by, like, a... a swordfish. Ellie's snoozing. Look, it's me. My name's Dave. That's a cute little tank top you got, Dave. Dude, this game loves Dave foot shots. That is literally like the fourth one. It's fine. Oh, shit. Job's not finished. Never mind. <laughs> Rocket, literal rocket. What is going on? Get that man a pillow. Was he not? Did he not have a? I almost said, was he not wearing a pillow? What was that about? It's a dream. <gasps> it's the credits. What the? F what's happening? What am I supposed to do here? Back, director. D director. Oh, shit. What am I supposed to do? Uh, do I have to shoot the... Goodbye, sir. Well, this is awful cute. Oops. <laughs> All right, well, we technically beat Dave the Diver. And now here's the thing. I Next thing I want to do, and I know this is like really mixed messaging, so I was just talking about how I'm excited to like get a new game in the stream lineup. But I want to see... Um, what exactly 
is involved in getting like 100% completion of Dave the Diver. Because if it's something that I realistically could do in like a reasonable time frame, I might go for it. Because just like from a video standpoint, it would make for a lot more of a satisfying video to say like, I got 100%. Like I 100% completed Dave the Diver and not just like... Because like people will still enjoy it and it'll still be fun if it's just like, hey, let's play Dave the Diver. But... Get owned. Uh, am I killing all these people? Because they're ghosts or like, I guess I'm killing all these people. Sorry, guys. Animator, you did an incredible job. And it's actually unbelievable how much animation was in this game. It's absurd. Whoops, sorry. Whoops. Min Sik Choi, lead animator. You're amazing. You did amazing. You're amazing. You guys are amazing. Graphics. Jesus, that's like a mega boss. All right, well, yeah, we'll we'll look up um, the Dave the Diver completion guide. I'm assuming to get 100%, we just have to get all the Steam achievements. I don't know how close we are. Probably not very, because I haven't been like catching all the fish or like some other thing, probably. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Game design all. Sorry. Game design all. Nolan King. See Nolan. <laughs> I love that. I love that you can see all the portraits because I was going to say like, <laughs> it's like the one white dude in these credits. I was like, I wonder if his little portrait is going to look like a white dude. And sure enough, it was just like a white dude. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Oh. I didn't get them all. That's fine. I missed six of them. What a shame. Their souls will never reach peace. What an odd dream. Thank you for playing. Thank you for making more like... Like, thank you for making the game. More like, well, that was awesome. We never did get out of October, did we? There's so much post credit shit going on. <gasps> Cobra. I'm still convinced that Cobra is going to be a twist villain at some point in this game. Achievement. Sleep all Dave? Yeah, I finally got some sound sleep. I even dreamed I was exploring space. Well then, checking any unfinished business. I got a reward. New content, minigame space diver. Adorable. Alright, I'm checking Steam. Alright, I have 60% of the achievements right now. Uh, I'm going to go potty really fast, so I'll be right back.
Okay, sorry, I'm all done. It smells terrible in my room. My room usually smells nice, but I, like, got really lazy the last week with, like, leaving food out. Because <laughs> I was so busy, and also I'm out of, like, air freshener pods. So my room smells yucky, and that makes me sad. So I need to go get more, like, air freshener things. Um, okay. Hi. Sorry <laughs> for bitching for a little bit there. Let's see what uh, achievements I'm missing here. There's also three hidden ones. Uh, we've got catch 10 fish with a sniper rifle. What do you mean catch 10 fish with a sniper rifle? I guess shoot them and then catch them. Okay, so snipe some fish. Uh, very doable. Enhance a gun three times. Very doable. We have two out of three. Um, Gumo seaweed farm. We just haven't gotten that far in the game yet probably. Momo Seeker. Get to know Momo a little better. We seem to feed Momo more. Uh, research some more dishes is very doable. Bancho Sushi forms a branch restaurant. There's just a lot of content left. Collect all the weapon blueprints. We're missing three. Diamond rank. Uh, capture all the sea people murals. Train employees to level 20. Feed the cat 20 times. Sell 200 items at the workshop. I've sold zero items. Uh, capture five fishmon, raise five giaos. That sounds annoying. And then three hidden ones. Very doable, but also very grindy. Hmm. I kind of like the ending we got. I think we could call it here, honestly. I know the video would be better if it was like, I got 100%, but... I don't know. I'm constantly at this, like, crossroads. Okay, let me save and quit either way. Save and return to title. Uh, I'm constantly at this, like, crossroads here. Um... Between making the kind of videos that I, like, always wanted to make if I was a YouTuber. <sighs> and making the kind of videos that I know will do better. And, because it's like, it's, it's both of my true wants. My true wants on YouTube are to make the kind of content that I love. That I, I usually like to watch personally. And... My other true want is to, I don't know, have as many people as possible see my videos. So, and sometimes both are not possible. It's like, I know, a, a, like, a, a, like YouTube is all about premise-based content right now. And it always performs better if it's like, this game, but blah. Or, I did this. Like, I got 100% perfection. 100% completion. Uh, and those are great. Like, I'm not bashing on that style of video. I, mean, I don't have, like, a heightened taste. But the kind of content that I've always loved and wanted to make is, like, the more just chilled out, like, a whole playthrough of a game in one video. And just the premise is just that I'm playing the game. And so, like, the times that I have to make a video like that and it does really well are my favorite things in the world. Like, the Undertale video is, like, that is a, a literal perfect example of the kind of content I've always wanted to make. And it did really well. I don't even know how many views it has right now. Let's see. Wow, 2.2 million views right now on the Undertale video. But like, that's exactly it. It's like, the, it's just a playthrough in Undertale. Title is just, let's beat Undertale without killing anyone. Thumbnail is just Undertale. Like, that's the exact kind of content I've always wanted to make. Or like, I don't know. The, uh, the Little Nightmares ones where it's just like, hey, let's, just, let's play Little Nightmares. Deltarune, let's beat Deltarune. <laughs> Stuff like that is like my favorite. Um, ever the Everhood video, just Everhood. Like even, even the like full movie thing. Whenever I do it in a video title or thumbnail, feels a little disingenuous because it feels like I'm trying. Because it is, it's not like it feels like I am trying to ride the wave of the YouTube algorithm. And that videos that have like full movie in them for whatever reason tend to do really well because it's just like a popular like buzz word, buzz phrase. I mean put on my little birds. You have something to look at. It's not just black. Like buzz phrase that usually does well. 
So like a lot of times it's like because if I just called it like I beat Minecraft for the first time, it probably wouldn't do as well as if it had full movie at the end. That's just kind of the unfortunate truth. Um, so I might just have this be like I beat all of Dave the Diver, and then that's it, Dave the Diver. Because that's the kind of content that I want to make, and it might not do as well, but that's like my dream kind of content. And it might, it's, I know it sounds late, I because it is. This is something I've thought about for a while within myself. It's like, am I just being lazy subconsciously by like preferring to make videos that are more chill in terms of like no premise? I honestly prefer not having like a voiceover and intro at the beginning, but I've been doing it more recently because videos do better when I have them. But I kind of prefer just like the like really simple style, just like my little intro card plays and then we're playing the game. And then it's just cut up game footage with not that many edits. Like the Undertale video is just such a great example of like the exact style I've always wanted. And so I'm very happy that video did so well. But I know that that is an exception because the Undertale fandom is so voraciously passionate about their favorite game that I can't expect that for everything. But yeah, I'm probably just going to make this just we're playing Dave the Diver. And that's that. I'll think about because I know the video would do better. If it had like a voiceover to intro, but yeah, we'll see. We'll see where it goes. The point is, I think we're done. I think this is the final day of the diver stream. Um, don't think I'll be going for a hundred percent because I don't know. I beat the game, and for that I am at peace and pleased. And now we have a little bit of time on our hands. There's a lot of things I could I could do right now. Um, I'm tempted to just do more U quizzes. <laughs> Those are funny. Um, Roblox is always fun, of course. Some other stuff is out there, <laughs> I'm told. Uh, let's see. Let me scroll through my Steam window as well. Hmm. We're just going to do some U-Quiz. We're just going to do some U-Quiz, and it's going to be fun. And we're going to have fun doing... U-Quiz. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let me... Open the U quiz. U quiz. Okay, let me let me get some music here as well. Um, oops, now it's all black. This is called uh, calming Animal Crossing. So we're gonna we're gonna be calm. We're gonna listen to some Animal Crossing. This is boring me. We're going to this one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry everybody. All right, now Google Chrome. What are we doing, y'all? Look at all these quizzes we could take. Most of them are about media franchises I've never heard of. Guessing what you're failing in school. What fruit are you? How chronically online are you? Yeah, we're doing that. Enter your name. Uh, poopy. All caps. All right. Question one. Yippee. This shit is what I'm talking about. This is like what you quiz is. It's like, it's like a cesspool of the whole like XD random kind of thing. Most questions are like this. Uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, see, I get that it's because it's supposed to be a chronically online thing. That's old. Pepe the Frog. Okay. 
What does this mean? Oh, it means kill yourself. <laughs> Pick one. YouTube. Pick one again. Twitter. I love Twitter. Last question. Whatever. Shut up. Watergate. Like water talk? I guess it's like water talk. Do you know what the Daily Wire is? Yes. You know about random chat box? Uh, no. Here it is. Bye. That was an awful quiz. Touch grass. Thanks, man. All right. That was really bad. Um, I'm doing it, everyone. <laughs> Would you be my type? What public school event slash scandal are you? Middle school. Dude, this is a middle schooler who made this? That is awesome. Equestria Girls, please. I'll do that next because there are three consecutive people who asked for that. I'm not familiar with Equestria Girls. Which one of these would you most likely say? Why am I being sniffed? I'm not crack or cocaine. Oh, God. This is a middle schooler who wrote down, like, quote, like, out of context quotes from their 12-year-old friends. <laughs> this is hilarious. Uh... Yeah. Pick a song, but no Taylor Swift. Uh, I'm not familiar with literally any of these except for this one. I know of Mother Mother. So I'm just going to pick that one or whatever. Pick a movie. The Menu. <laughs> I go clueless. Would you kill someone for fun? No. He's telling you a school sandal. Christmas time. I have a full minute. That I, this was supposed to be like five seconds. I can tell. Pick a thing. I only have literally a minute. Uh, piece of clothing. Okay, eat it. Yay. Gym teacher put cams in the girls' locker room and getting fired. Oh, you're not allowed to do that. All right, well... I'll do the Equestria Girls one for y'all. I'm going to put my name as Kenna because Kenna asked first. <laughs> okay. You are... I'm an introvert. I am a Taurus. I like that I get my own one. That's nice. Choose a song. Uh, yeah, I'll take Nova Kane. I like how the title and author are swapped. <laughs> For like half of these. <laughs> Choose an aesthetic. Uh, I don't know, man. None of these. She's a necklace. I'm not a girl. <laughs> uh, this one's pretty cool. That looks like some outer wild shit. Your favorite Winx fairy. What is Winx? I'll let you, whoever knows what Winx is, y'all pick. Thank you for the gift subscribers. That's too kind. Jert Junior Jidfiv. Thank you. <laughs> it's a fairy show. Okay. We got Flora Flora. Sailor Moomba Fairies. I dig it. How do you usually spend your time? Reading slash studying, hanging out with friends, shopping, sports slash music connected hobbies. It's one of these two. Hanging out with friends, probably. What is your approach to solving problems? I do hang out with friends very often. I just have, I have no ability. I was trying to think of the word inability and literally almost said disability. That would have been uh, pretty tragic. I'm trying to say I have, I, I have an inability. <laughs> that would have been so bad. I almost said, I have a disability to say no to friends when they ask to hang out, no matter how much work I have to do. Inability. I ha I am unable to ever say no. It, no matter how much, like, behind I am on work or anything. If one of my friends texts me and is like, hey, you want to play 2K? I'm online right now. I'll be like, yeah, man. I'm turning on my PS5 right now. <laughs> like, regardless of how much work I have to get done. What is your approach to solving problems? Analyzing the situation, coming with a logical solution, being optimistic, um, tackling the problem, hard work, using creativity, face problem with bravery. I, I honestly just face problem with bravery. Uh, cry. 
feel like I try to analyze. I'd like to think so. It was Winks your gay awakening? It was one of the gay awakenings. Oh my god, how many did you have? You kept gay sleeping. <laughs> Stop gay sleeping. Do you curse a lot? Uh, yeah. It's mostly involuntary at this point. What do you look for in a romantic partner? Hmm. <laughs> Let's see here. Funny is kind of my trump card. I don't know what that says about me. Pick a high school stereotype. Nerd, popular cheerleader, art freak, no friends, class clown, theater kid, or fruity. Shut up. I'll go nerd, man. I love a nerd. Choose a Monster High character. Another uh, franchise I know nothing about. I'm picking on name, though. This one's I'm taking. Give me a... Um, Laguna. That's it. You can write anything you want. I will read replies, and I would really appreciate hearing from you. Have a nice day. In case you want to talk, at Train of Despair, my Instagram. Okay, well, we're reaching out to this person. No, that's stupid. <laughs> I got Pinkie Pie. <laughs> I like the turtle. The turtle with the chef hat is awesome. She looks like the candy person from Cuphead. I'm the life of the party. It's true. I'm not reading all this, by the way. Sorry. <laughs> I don't have it in me. You're not saying some wax shit under my name. <laughs> I forgot for that. That's really funny. Okay. Uh, would I stock your Spotify? Let's find out. Enter your name. Uh, pfft. Crumply. Do you think music taste says a lot about a person? Genuinely, no. What music era do you listen to most? <laughs> Probably 2020s, if I'm being honest. Best way to listen to music? Uh, headphones. Pick a musician slash band. None, but I'll go with Nirvana. Lots of posters in your room? Not about not music stuff, so I guess I'll say no. It's mostly other wall decoration stuff. Pick a general genre. Uh, either indie or rap. I guess I'll go indie. Uh, Psychedelia? Yeah, who knows what that is. Pick a musician slash band. Arctic Monkeys, The Doors, Elton John, Cigarettes After Sex, The Smiths, and Harry Styles. Uh, Smiths. So this is any of these. Cape Town, Miski. Nope. Not heard of any. Well, I've heard of Miski a million times, but no. Pick a musical soundtrack. Mean Girls, Rocky Horror Picture Show, Help, La La Land, Mamma Mia, Mamma Mia. I'm just going to be straight up. Lamau. Are any of your main interests? Art oh, your main artists, my face. Dave Bowie, Beatles, Led Zeppelin, Zombies, Eagles, Pink. No. Fart. Pop quiz. Who is this? I don't know who that is. <laughs> bye. Oh. Drop your Spotify for me to stock. Limo. Okay, bye. Shut up. No. <laughs> okay. See you. Gaha is absurd. I'm sure you're a better person than me when I when it when it comes to judging people. Gaha. <laughs> that's, that's really funny. <laughs> Sorry, Crumply. Um, what do I think you smell like? Dr. Death. Let's get started. Do you have any siblings? I do. Uh, what birth order are you? I am... I'm actually going to let y'all guess. If you, if you know... I know I've asked this before. But if you know, don't say it. People who don't know... Which of these is accurate to my uh, family situation? Middle, middle, young, middle. I think the last time I asked this, I think I got a lot of middle as well. That's kind of crazy. Second oldest, oldest. <laughs> Decent oldest. Second, I see. Youngest. Wow, this is crazy. Oh, 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 Paul, I love it. 
Look at that. Middle, dude. Middle just crushing. That's crazy. Vote now on your phones. Yeah. Seriously. Okay, well, I might go ahead and cut it off here. Wow, I'm really liking the results of this poll. I can't wait for the announcement. All right, gang. Time has run out. Middle wins out. The answer. Is youngest. Eight of you win. There are eight winners. Music taste. Taylor Swift, Dua Lipa, Ava Max, Ed Sheeran, Olivia Rodrigo. Nope. Nope. Closer. Way closer. Kanye with sometimes in all caps is incredibly real, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pick it. Okay. What do you listen to? Uh, breathing. <laughs> Choose a color and a scent. I love green, but I'm not big on lavender. I love cedarwood, but I'm not big on red. What a shame. I'll go green and lavender. Choose a word. Lemony. Yeah, okay. We're going to go with dusk. It's nice to say. Choose a direction. Right, left, up, down. Well, not right and left because I have a hard time with right and left. I'll go down. I'm pretty down to earth. Choose a shape. Uh, circled my favorite easily. It's very nice to draw. We have a skincare routine. Uh... Technically, I have one, um, I have three products in my bathroom. I have my shampoo and conditioner two in one. I have my body wash and then I have like a facial cleanser thing that I just rub on my face in the shower. Um, is that this? Cause I don't have a moisturizer. Um, I guess I'll say no. Cause I don't think it's enough for people to like. Consider it, whatever. Do you spray perfume? Never. It really, really wrecks my sinuses in my head. What's your signature scent if you have one? I've had people in my life tell me that I just smell really strongly like laundry detergent. <laughs> so we'll put that in. There we go. Men's deal. That's incredibly accurate. <laughs> that's literally, that's exactly right. I'm like, I'm just naturally not a very pungent person. Like I was just kind of given the gift since birth of really not having any issues with BO. So if I just, if I put on my deodorant in the morning, which I do every morning now, I just smell like deodorant all day. <laughs> like faintly. And my clothes just smell like a laundry detergent. A little musty. I don't like that you called me musty. But you're funny as hell, not gonna lie. I love you. Mwah. Thanks. Wow, look at all these. Like a fruit basket. Just clean. Yay. Let's get that as because I also smell like men's deodorant. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Um... Let me guess what you're bad at. Oh, are you attractive? Yes, please. It's a dog looking at me in the background. Um, Starburst. What's your gender? I'm boy. What's your eye color? My eye hazel. How tall am I? Centimeters! Centigrade? Uh, let's see how many 72 70 I'm 74 inches. So I'm 180 about 188 centimeters probably more like 187 Because I'm not like I'm like barely under 6'2 Um, let's see I already forgot. Okay, there we go 
Uh, do you make up? I've never done it, but who knows? Okay. How many hours of sleep do you usually get? I'd say six to nine is accurate. Are you confident? Depends. Describe yourself with one word. Dude, sexy? Are you kidding me? Sexy, cute, acne, ugly, or skip? I'd feel bad describing myself as any of these. Genuinely. These two would make me feel bad about myself. These two would make me feel like an asshole. So I'm gonna skip. Do you think you're attractive? Depends. <laughs> On the eyes of the beholder. Do you get eye contact often with strangers? I don't know. I'm not looking out to see people are looking at me. Sometimes. I don't know. You can vent here. Dude, imposter vent. <laughs> Funny stuff. I'm stunning. <laughs> Thanks. Ugh. I'm stunning, hot, sexy, attractive, beautiful, and perfect. I'm sure this is the only result. Yeah. Whatever. I don't. Shut up. I don't care about your social agenda. I want to know if I'm hot. You've wasted my time. Okay. Would I like you Christian edition? I should not be. I'm not. I'm not going to take that. Your Greek godfather. Fuck it. Answer truthfully. Here we go. I am kind of signing myself up here to get um actually by all the mythology people, but that's fine. Uh, Andromeda. Okay. Choose the one that speaks to you. Just pick one that you think is pretty, which to me means the same shit, but that's fine. Oh, this is so cool. A butterfly on fire? Yeah. Your favorite red. Puppy little demigod. I hate this one. I don't like this one. I really don't like this one. It's a nice red. What Harry Potter house are you in? I took a quiz finally and I got Slytherin. So. Slytherin. Favorite interpretation of Percy Jackson. The books, the movies, the show. Uh, I've said a million times on the channel that I've never consumed any Percy Jackson or Percy Jackson related content or anything like that. Um... But I did just watch the all this show that was out with my roommates, and we thought uh, the dialogue sucked, but we had a fun time watching the show. Um, I'm still going to go with books, which I haven't read, <laughs> just because I hated both of these. Well I, well, I hate it. This was terrible, but fun. This was less terrible, but less fun. So, the books. Do you believe in a higher power? All right. You quiz is getting pretty personal here. Um, I think it's a little unfair to put free thinker in the no category, implying that you can't be a free thinker if you're even a little religious. That feels a little bit uh, insensitive, but I am not particularly religious as a person. What is your eye color? Stop saying this. It's, it's gr I don't like it. I am uncomfortable. Hazel. What is your zodiac sign? Taurus. What is your go-to accessory? Purse, a necklace, a ring, an anklet, a headband or hat, no accessories. No accessories. Uh, for a while I wore rings occasionally and then I lost both my rings. I'm like literally devastated. One of them was really expensive and one of them is really sentimental and can't be. Like there are no more of them that I can get. So that's pretty sad. I mean, I'm sure it's somewhere. I just got to look like really closely, but yeah. Yeah. A little upsetting. So I've been raw dogging it for a while. Arrows. Dude, I am. All of these quizzes are telling me I'm hot. Every single one of these quizzes is just trying to hammer home that I'm hot. I'm the, the god of carnal love. Jesus. You're a little gossip, aren't you? No. I do not. Okay, well. Never beating the hot allegation. It's true. Okay. Um, here's if you're bored. If you were a fictional character, what extremely basic description would the fandom give you? What does that even mean? What do you identify as? Amon. Are you gay? Okay. <laughs> Here's the thing. 
I've made it pretty clear an abundant number of times on the channel that I'm not yet ready <laughs> to reveal my romantic and sexual preferences. So I'm gonna leave it up to fate and I'm gonna pick whatever is randomly assigned because I don't wanna give y'all any clues or, or uh, narrow it down at all. I want it to stay an absolute mystery until I decide. So we're gonna do <laughs> a random number generator. Here we go. Random number generator. One through three. It's a two, so no. Someone text you, we can talk. Nope. Someone text you, can we talk? ASAB, assign sexuality at blindfold. <laughs> That's exactly right. Uh. Yeah, I'd probably be like, yeah. <laughs> Introvert. Stance on horoscopes. Um, no strong opinion. I'm not one of their bullshit and mean nothing because I don't believe in them at all, but I'm not going to shut you down if you believe in them because I don't care. I'm going to shut you down if you're an asshole about it. Got to keep the people wondering. That's the idea. I don't want to give y'all any clues. If you were in a horror movie, what would your role be? Um, I would probably die pretty fast. I'm very fragile. And I feel like uh, appearance-wise, I am very unassuming. So I think I'd be like an extra that would get killed to prove a point. Uh, why is it any blue? How's this photo make you feel? I'm afraid pretty nothing. <laughs> so, whoops. Uh, what about this one? Oh, this is fun. Is that shark? I'd say happy. Pick a word. Wow. Cringe is the funniest word in the world. <laughs> just because of how many like kids use it in like a obnoxious way that just makes it funnier. It's it's like hit the pog window for me. Okay, there we go. Um sarcastic one is actually nice. Folks who participate in fandoms. Uh how many <laughs> How many characters do you describe it? Sarcastic one is actually nice. <laughs> oh, thank god I didn't get this shit. I would have literally just ended stream on the spot without saying anything. Thank the Lord. Yeah, these are fun. You quiz is fun because it's a nice cross section to a part of the internet that I just had never had any experience with. Well, I just finished watching the Percy Jackson show, so fuck it. Let's find my Percy Jackson best friend. On one word. Uh, this is by Blues Clues. Are you a dog person or a cat person? I'm a dog person. What color hair do you have? I have brown hair. Pick a season. Fall is my favorite. Be an introvert or extrovert. Everyone wants to know. It's your love language. Dude. I don't know. I think it's uh, quality time. What is your hate language? Violence, stealing, gossip, and slander. Sabotage and neglect. Slander. <laughs> Just a man manner of physical affection. Firm hug. High five. Dude, a high five. Yeah. I love high fives so much. High fives and fist bumps. I don't know who that is. So. Yeah. I don't know who you are. That's fine. <laughs> we'll get there later in the show, I presume. Uh... I literally feel so bad. I thought this was a keyboard smash. <laughs> I thought someone punched their keyboard. Guys, <laughs> it was an actual. Whoops. All right. Um. Well, we've run out. Well, I skipped a bunch, so let's let's go back. Let's search something instead. What do you guys want to find out? What do you guys want to learn about me? Whether it be a media franchise or just like what fruit you are. <laughs> I 
I think I'm 12. 13 is lying about my age. What? I think I'm like 12 to 13 and my family is faking my age help. It's a personality quiz. All right. In a moment. Oh my God. Okay, we're done. No, get away, Nico. I don't know who you are. Okay. Um, let's see. We got bread. Dave the Diver. Bread. K-pop. Papa's. My Chemical Romance. What game you are? Do the bread one. What does that mean? Oh, my God. Okay, I'll just type in bread, and then we'll do a K-pop one. Which bread are you? How many questions? 11. Pick a Lego shop to get your bread from. Okay, this one is not. Uh, there we go. Not that one. Absolutely not. Uh, this is very cute. Then again, this is also very cute. I'm going to go with this one, actually. Pick a time during the night. Oh, 11 p.m. is my favorite for sure. Okay. Uh, pick a picture that makes me lose it on sight. Like laughing? These are not funny. I'm sorry. This is the kind of thing I'm talking about. About like I feel like I might not vibe on Tumblr. What is this? This is pretty funny. <laughs> the Garfield one's pretty funny. Okay. Whatever. And another one. Is that dream? Okay, whatever. Uh, this is terrible. I don't care about any of these. That's Is that the Texas flag or the Chile flag in the background? They're like really similar. Uh, whatever. This one's whatever. Pick something someone put in my last quiz open text box. Okay. Um, uh, all the Dutch people were like, I'm just going to Yeah, okay, sure. Uh, make a wish on something. You know, Quotes time from my friends. I bet these are going to be funny. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not. Furry boyfriend. Amity girlfriend. There's too many things. This is too overwhelming. As I told my he said, is Party Rock with us in the house tonight? That's good. Okay. That's good, Tumblr. This is Tumblr in 2011, I'm not, I promise. Okay, not a fan of any of these, really. I'll go with the furry boyfriend one because I'm just overwhelmed by how much there is in, in here. Uh, oh God, oh God, there's more. What does this mean? It's fine, it's fine. This is fine, whatever, whatever. Shoot of cards. Um, clubs. Tell me something. Um. <laughs> Couldn't do it. <laughs> Couldn't bring myself. This is being on Michael. Is this Michael? Is that Michael? I guess that's Michael. Um, I bet it has tiny arms. This is a waste of time. Yeah, this was a total waste of time. Okay, that was an absolute waste of time. Um, it's mostly TikTok humor that Therm doesn't understand. I understand everything. What are you talking about? I don't I don't misunderstand anything. K 
K-pop. <laughs> As you guys requested. Uh, what do you guys think? Oh, I like what you don't buy fight. Oh, yeah. I don't think I can fight at all. Oh, you can't see it. <laughs> 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 Sorry, guys. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> what slur? <laughs> what slur are you is crazy. I'm sure it exists on here. We're not taking it for obvious reasons. The one that just says K pop. Has, yeah. The one that just says K pop. And has zero takers. No one has taken this quiz before. <laughs> How many questions? Oh, it broke. Sometimes quizzes break. That's a shame. I really want to take this one. <laughs> Come on. Let me in. Ah, uh, please. Ugh, we're gonna have to try again later. Sometimes this website just breaks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can really want to take that. <laughs> All right. What slutty K-pop boy is your emotional support boy? Gross. Chris, Chris password. All right, we can't take that one. It's privated. Um, that was clearly just made for a friend group. K-pop. What K-pop idol would you commit a crime with? What kind of K-pop stan are you? Do you have taste K-pop edition? Well, I can't do that. I want like a what are you because I could still get an attainable answer without knowing anything. Uh, what crusty white K-pop dog are you? Which one of Amber's favorite K-pop idols are you? Do you know Ashlyn's K-pop references? K-pop. Uh, whoa. Open text box K-pop. Uh, which one of my silly K-pop boys are you? Uh, I mean, K-pop biases. This is too much. I don't understand. Uh, okay. We're just gonna take the, the, this one. It's loading. It's loading. Quiz password. Oh my god. Well. We're doing something else. Clearly K-pop isn't meant to be. Uh, that's what we do on my chemical romance one. So I'm gonna do my chemical romance. This is another music group I know literally nothing about. What my chemical romance album? Is it okay if it's album instead of song? Is that okay? Okay, cool. <laughs> now I gotta center it again. What my chemical romance album are you? It's all black. Are you afraid of dying? Uh, yeah. Greatest existential fear. Jesus, man, this is edgy. I'm falling so deep into despair that I'm not able to bring myself out of it again. Dying before I get the chance to be my life means something. Uh. Oh, uh, bah. Sure, this is accurate. Pick an element. Um, air. There's a ghost that haunts your bedroom. What does it look like? A shadow. Jesus, this is so dramatic. Oh my god. Oh my lord. Oh my god. This is so dramatic. What do you do about the ghost? There's <laughs> 14 questions. We're speedrunning this. Uh, I'll just avoid it. <laughs> Pick a 2020. Here we go. Pick a 2020 Oscar nomination for best picture. 1917 Parasite, Marriage Story, Little Women, Once Upon a Time, Irishman, Joker, Jojo Rabbit, Parasite. Which subculture did you most identify with in middle school? Uh, what is scene? Weeb. Metal. None. 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 <laughs> None of these. Literally as far from all of these as you could possibly be. In middle school? Seems emo but cooler. Oh, Jesus. Okay, none. Pick a dead poet society quote. Uh, We don't... Oh, God. 
this is long. Okay. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> Pick the temperament that best fits you. Oh my god, dude. This is... I'm like frustrated taking this quiz. Like, this is just one of those quizzes where I can imagine that the person who made it would be pretty rough to be around and hang out with. It went away. There you go. This is so pretentious. I know what these words mean, and you probably don't. Sanguine literally just means blood. It's just freaking blood. The four temperaments, the theory of psychology about personality. It's just there are four bodily fluids that affect personality traits and behavior. I don't know. Oh my god. Whatever. Okay, let me like learn what they are, please. Okay, element this works. Uh sanguine probably. Everyone always tells me if I was in Avatar it'd be air. So we're going sanguine. Choleric is absurd. I know sanguine means bloody. I didn't know that. But like, I didn't know the rest of it. Well, well phlegm is self-explanatory. What's your worst quality? I get angry. I'm overly emotional. I'm overly aggressive. I'm bad setting boundaries. I'm self-pitying. I can be careless. I overthink things. Or I'm self-righteous. Uh, I can be very careless, but I also kind of get angry easily. I, I'll, I'll go careless. What's your best quality? Dude, I'm awesome. <laughs> Maybe I should have put self-righteous for the last one. Uh, I think I'm creative. Uh, really depends. My mom thinks I'm an optimist. But I feel like I, no matter what I did, my mom would think I'm an oven because she's my mom. I like green. Choose a conventional weapons volume. What is this dude? I hate this person. Just pick a weapon. Yeah, see, the way this is phrased means you could have named this question, pick a weapon. But instead, you wanted to be like, hey, I know this fancy terminology thing, and then I'm going to give you a condescending jab if you've never heard of it. Or just pick a weapon. In parentheses. Shut up, dude. Axes. Spider. This is so long. Oh my god, you've never even heard of MCR. <laughs> Good job, whoever made this quiz. Is this really the full title? That's a long ass album, dude. Their title. Yeah, that's a lot. Okay. You're great at first impressions and super fun at parties. Thanks, man. I'm leaving. <laughs> Conventional weapons are in my chem series of EPs. Oh, thank God. Uh. Hey, which one of these two has been hotel character ones that I take? <laughs> I did this one. Let's do this other one. <laughs> we're gonna f we're gonna get a second opinion. <laughs> I mean, two out of the, like, five front page with the same shit, so I gotta take both. Color describes your personality. I don't know what color describes my personality. My favorite's green. What do you guys think my personality is like? You guys are gonna say something mean. This is what always happens. No matter what. You guys are gonna be like, something strong. You're like, white! Or like, black! Red! Every freaking time. What animal would it be? Rat! Yeah, no, this is about personality. I know my branding is purple, but it's about personality. Pink, 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 agreed pink. I think it's yellow. An interesting, oh, now yellow's getting some traction. Yellow or pink, yellow. Pink. <laughs> kind of music do you listen to? Oh my, this, this is a great playlist. I really enjoy this. It's called Gone Fishing. I'm going to save it to my playlist of of uh, video game soundtrack playlist that I like. Tutorial. Nostalgic video game music playlist. Yeah, F it. Okay. Uh. What kind of music do you listen to? Uh, electronic. Introvert extra every time, dude. What did you do on a day off? Uh, hang on, friends. Favorite song of the show so far? Again, man... This is a lot, dude. There's a lot of songs in this show. Holy shit. 
Uh, dude, I don't know. I'm gonna pick loser baby because I like the idea of there being no comma, and it's just about a like a loser baby. <laughs> like they're just dunking on a baby. Freaking loser baby. Are you a top, bottom, or switch? Gross. All right. Jesus. Why do you have to do this? This is another uh, common trend with you quiz is crossing boundaries. <laughs> Always. We're just going to say none for now and move on. This always happens. What would your friends describe you as? I don't know, man. Goofy. <laughs> Favorite snack. <laughs> Fuck nasty. <laughs> My favorite snack is chips. Favorite sin? Okay. Uh, pride, wrath. I'm gonna pick this based on Isaac. Uh, we'll go pride. Your moral alignment. Dude, I don't know. I feel like this is not the kind of thing I should be allowed to decide for myself. This is awful. You quiz in general is like for 16 year olds. Yeah, it's true. Chaotic good slash neutral. Sure. Choose something. A photo of someone you don't like. Yeah. <laughs> Especially if it's a bad one. Expensive whiskey, big fluffy pillow, vacuum sound, Spotify playlist. That's Shawnee right there. Broken phone charger. Absolutely not. What are you talking about? Here's your bug zipper, whatever, 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 whatever. Yeah. Absolutely a photo of someone you don't like. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, sorry. That's really judgmental. That's a really judgmental way to respond to seeing a character you've never heard of. This is just like, man. Thinking about this art style, like. Whatever. <laughs> like, I'm trying to figure out how to put this into words. Yeah, I've got nothing. Can we try the bread again? That's true. I'm over time, but I'm having too much fun. I don't really have that much to do today, so we're going to keep going. I'm just going to look up bread. Uh, which type of bread are you? Okay. Uh, choose color. Green's my favorite. Choose your dream date. Staying in and watching a movie, beach, fancy restaurant, wandering around the city. Wondering, sorry. Wondering around the, around the city. <laughs> I wonder where we are. I don't like going on dates, clever walk in the park. Walk in the park is lovely. Favorite subject. Uh, math of these. You're going out. I don't know the occasions. Don't ask me. What are you wearing, though? Um, thrifted outfit. She's a main course meal. Cereal for me, I guess only for breakfast, but like I'm thinking of like lunch or dinner. Uh, chicken is the most versatile thing in the world. Choose a dessert. Yeah. Nope. This is a macaroon. The coconut one. I'm sure that's not what they meant, but the coconut one isn't as good. Macaron is my favorite dessert in the world. So I'm going to do ice cream. What decade do you want to live in? Now. What are you talking about? I'm very comfortable here. Dream vacation spot. Europe, Florida. The number of people who are always like, oh, I was born in the wrong generation. I wish I could be alive in the 50s. What the fuck are you saying? Do you know what was going on in the 50s? You want to be alive in the 50s? Anyway. Um, uh, Europe, probably. Preferably Northern Europe. I'd like to go to like Norway or something. Dream job. Um, if I was alive in the 50s, I'd be hate crime. You would be dead. Like, I'm not trying to be... Unsupportive, but yeah, no, absolutely not. Uh, I like my phone on my rights. That's exactly right. I love phone. And yeah, yeah. Also, isn't it so crazy how the only people I ever see saying I wish I was alive in the 50s are dudes? Pretty wild. <laughs> dream, dream job. 9 of 11. Oh my god. <laughs> dream job. Something in fashion. Something in the restaurant business. Business. No job. DJ. Bartender. Instagram. Can you DJ? 
Pick a short, quick, tiny little quote. I'm making up on the spot. Zonx. Wow, you're too funny. Why is the tempo? You should really walk all over it. Funny. Yeah, good one. This really might be part of the live action Scooby Doo movies. It's not a quote, this is just a thought. Nothing matters because we're all going to end up dead anyways. Yeah, really? Is this a quote that you just came up with on the spot? <laughs> Holy bread. This is false, by the way. I'm not a vegan or a keto. Though I will say, um, all of my sandwich chis. <laughs> I got the rarest one. Um, all of my sandwiches that I eat are on like the nature made whole wheat bread. So <sighs> I guess that works. All right, I should end stream. We're gonna do another one. I'm having fun. Um, I'm I'm taking the wheel on this one. I want to take another. I'm I'm on a Percy Jackson kick. Um, God, parent, <laughs> Greek God parent quiz. I'm gonna press the Jackson quiz. That has 350,000 people have taken this. Um, my name is, you know what? This is the last one. So I'm just gonna do Thomas. Last quiz, y'all. What color are your eyes? Hazel. If you had a free day, y'all are learning a lot about me with this. You had a free day, what would you be doing? Hang out with friends. Oh, there's so many options. Swimming, man, I wonder who that is. Biking, watching TV alone, playing outside with your friends. Yeah, maybe. Playing or practicing music, hiking in the forest, creating something cool, playing sports. Oh, having your friends over is more like Either that or playing sports, probably. Uh, out of all the animals listed here, which one is your favorite? Oh, there are a lot. Sparrows, hawks are awesome. Um. Yeah, hawks are awesome. Okay, which of these is most important to you? It's hard to read this damn text with Zeus eyeing me in the background. Um, friendship. Oh, humor. It is humor. If we're being honest. What is your favorite color? Yeah, like how funny someone is is directly related to how much I enjoy being around them. My favorite color is green. Am I stupid? Why is my only option light green? Whatever. How's your room decorated? Oh my god, dude. Pink, blue with a waterbed. Shut up. Um, Dark blue. Yellow with flowers and birds. Black. Check out the music notes. None of these. Yeah, literally none of these. What is your biggest fatal flaw? Beauty. <laughs> That's funny. Um, impulsive. I am Dionysus, baby. I am Dionysus, baby. I'm not an alcoholic, for starters. Father's Dionysus, the god of wine, parties, and happiness. You're a very bright, cheery person who loves to hang out with your friends. I do love to hang out with my friends. How did you know? It's... <laughs> Crazy. You just <laughs> did this person get shot <laughs> with her typing <laughs> the description of this quiz? <laughs> your special power is the ability to create an illusion to make people believe that they're having fun when they're really <laughs> like what happened? They got one letter out. That's <laughs> <laughs> so funny. <laughs> they were so close. <laughs> when they really. <laughs> Hephaestus is the most common one. Then Athena, then Hades, and Dionysus, and blah, blah, blah. Zeus is 1%. Alright, well, that's all, folks. I hope you enjoyed, uh,. Today's live stream. We're done with Dave the Diver. Oh, wait, I should say bye to you on the camera. Goodbye. Uh, it's been a pleasure. We'll be back uh, Friday.
for Outer Wilds, then Sunday for Spirit Fair, and then next Tuesday for something else. I'm not going to spin the wheel because I've already done two wheel games. I'm doing two wheel games right now. I'm going to do a planned thing next week. So I will I will make up my mind within the next week of, of what we're doing next week. I think I already have an idea of what it's going to be, though. And it's going to be crazy. <laughs> that really messed with my eye, by the way. Okay. Goodbye. Thanks for tuning in. That was fun. Uh, catch you later. <laughs>